Good morning, everyone. Welcome to October 22nd Market Minute. I'm John Hopkins, President of Invested Central. Right now, we get the Dow futures up 18, S&P futures are up 2, and NASDAQ futures are up 9. Asian shares were higher, while European shares were lower overnight. Futures were down ahead of the bell on Friday as the earnings picture began to deteriorate. The market opened weak and continued with the downward bias throughout the day. By the time the market closed, all of the major indexes had fallen substantially. There are no key economic reports due out today. Today we'll get earnings from Caterpillar, Texas Instruments, and Yahoo, to name a few. On the S&P, we've got the 20-day moving average at 1444, the 50-day at 1433, and the 200-day at 1373. The S&P closed at 1433 with support at 1425 and resistance at 1475. During earnings season, nothing matters more than the bottom line of corporate America. So far, traders are not so pleased with what they're seeing and hearing. Google, Microsoft, and GE are among the most recent companies to report disappointing earnings. This did not set well with traders, resulting in the deep selling on Friday. Now that the S&P has closed right on the 20-day moving average, the bulls will be challenged again to hold the line. If unsuccessful, watch for 1425, the October 12th low to hold, or 1403 could come into play. Make sure you clear your calendar for tomorrow's online trader series where our chief market strategist Tom Bully discusses historical trends and tendencies which are important when trading. To learn more, just click on the link below. This is John Hopkins. I'll be back tomorrow morning with another Market Minute.